Hey guys, how you doing? It's me, Alan here, at LFC Red Chat. Uh, you can make sure if you want to follow along with the show by getting in touch with all three of these right here on Twitter at LFC Red Chat, Facebook LFC Red Chat, and of course it is the address to this YouTube channel right here for you. So let's get stuck in. Liverpool Swansea coming up, Premier League. Mistakenly, I missed <laughs> I missed all the games this morning. Uh, on the 28th, I thought everybody was playing on the 29th, but it turns out it was just Liverpool playing on the 29th, so, oh well, fantasy, fantasy <laughs> Premier League took a little bit of a dive this week, but, um, yeah, so let's get let's get stuck into this game, a lot of stuff to go over, I got a lot of notes, so I really did well in the note taking part, but yeah, got a lot to talk about, okay, so usual thing, five things you need to know, referee wants to watch, trivia, stats, next games, and injuries. Okay, so number one thing that you need to know, Swansea have won the last two games, uh, one nothing. They beat Hull, and they also beat Villa, one nothing. keeping two clean sheets. Not a good little bit of form, good little bit of run. Number two thing that you need to know, Swansea are yet to score a, um, not yet to score a goal, yet to win a game at Anfield. They have drawn three and lost ten in their 13 visits so far. Uh, number three thing that you need to know, Wilfred Boney has scored the first goal of the game in three out of his last four starts. Uh, so, saying that he's on a good bit of a run, so he must have scored. Um, he, he's doing well when, when he starts the game. He's more than likely to start against Liverpool um, tomorrow. So, number four thing you need to know. Mignolet will be in goals for us. Brad Jones is uh, out with his thigh. Uh, and also to expect a rotated uh, Swansea side. <laughs> People like uh, Richards, Rutledge and Gomez is probably going to be up there with Boney. Uh, so don't expect a full strength one. I'm guessing Sigerson's going to be in because I don't think he played last... I uh, don't think he played on Boxing Day. So he'll be in for this game as well, I would predict. Number five thing you need to know. It talks a lot about, about Liverpool's home record. We have only taken 13 points in nine home games this season. The last season we had actually taken 24 at the same point. Of course, I don't like, if you watch my videos, you see that I don't really dip back into the past too often. But it's a good comparison to see how well we played at home before and how we are doing it now. Um, but, Star Starling has scored three in his last three games, so there's a, there's a little bit of hope there. And we're coming into a good run of uh, two home games here, so hopefully that points total can improve. The referee, the referee, the man in the black, the man in the middle is going to be Andre Mariner. Um, wants to watch from Swansea. Of course you're going to watch Boney because we're linked so often with the player. Uh, for me personally, I think it'd be a bit too expensive for what he brings out. But he has scored eight goals so far this season. Where's the number 10 jersey? Sigerson, if you, if you play Fantasy Premier League or if, you if you're into any of that stuff, you'll know that Sigerson is... Uh, is a key part of a team at the moment. He, he just produces and scores scores himself. Just a whole bunch of chances he creates. And uh, number four, the person who I backed at the start of the Premier at the start of the fantasy Premier League um, key, has completed eight hundred and ninety two passes on par with how Gerrard passes. If you want to look compared to to uh, Liverpool, he's also scored a couple of goals in the last couple of games. Yep, right after I dropped him out my my Premier League team, so. Oh well, right, let's look at the stats, and um, pretty similar really, for, for a team that's sitting in, um, where are we, we're in ninth and Swansea is 8th, but that's the time of the season, halfway through, pretty much the same, pretty much the same, Liverpool scored 22 goals, Swansea have scored 23, uh, Liverpool conceded 24, Swansea conceded 19, duels, headed duels in the air, uh, fifty two percent compared to forty six, passing actually eighty three to eighty four for Swansea. Yellow cards both have thirty four. Red cards, Liverpool have one. Uh, Swansea have had four pass. Uh, no possession. Sorry, fifty three percent compared to half. Uh, fifty percent for Swansea. Big thing is though, if you want to cast your mind back to goals, when I said that Liverpool have scored twenty two goals off of two hundred and two chances created. Swansea, on the other hand, have scored 23 goals off of only 147 chances. That, to me, means when they create a chance, they take it. Unlike Liverpool have been stuttering and sputtering in that sort of department when getting a chance to taking it. Next couple of games coming up. Leicester uh, at home. 
on New Year's Day. It's an early game, so make sure you remember that. I don't want to miss that. Then game after that is Sunderland away on the 10th. Um, injuries to take note of, like I mentioned before earlier in the video, Brad Jones will be out of this game. No Jones. Uh, probably going to see the young Welsh boy Ward on the bench. Instead, Lovren's doubtful. Joe Allen's doubtful. Glenn Johnson, Flanagan and Sturridge, all done. They're all out for this one. Only one really of note that I could find that I could see of Swansea was uh, Montero. He won't be playing. He, he's doubtful. Um, one person put it, other one put it as if he's out. So um, you probably won't see him. But yeah, I'm excited for this game. It is right in the middle of this run that pretty much everyone and their dog has been talking up for Liverpool that we need to go on and we need to really take advantage of this. So this is a key one, key game for us to to win if we really want aspirations of, of sneaking a top four place by the end of the year. It's, it's a big, big run of games for us uh, if we want to be doing that. So, trivia question if you want to know it. Phone's going off. Can you hear that? Phone's going off. Someone fucking answer it. <laughs> uh, a trivia question if you want to know. Who was the captain of Swansea when they were promoted when Brendan Rodgers was the manager? So who was the captain when Brendan Rodgers was the manager and they won promotion via the playoffs beating Reading on the way um, up to the Premier League is where they are just now, staying. Uh, so yeah, that's the that's the pre-match build-up show, the pre-match, um, what did I say, the preview show is how I call it. Uh, if you like it, make sure you subscribe up above or down below. Comments down below, um, if you can get on there quick enough, these comments will be added into tonight's comment show, episode 4, if you want to check that out, 30 minutes or more of just pure Liverpool stuff going through the week that was. And a little bit extra, seeing I'm a little bit late on it because of Christmas and of course Christmas Eve. If not, if you if you reply to this video a little bit later than that, you'll get bumped onto the next comment show. So keep that in mind, guys. Make sure you get involved. Make sure you you're hitting subscribe, thumbs up the video, comments down below, thumbs down if you didn't like it. Uh, Facebook. Uh, make sure you bookmark my, my YouTube page as well so you can keep up to date. And as of yet, so far, if you want to know, I don't think Red Men did a, a preview video for this one yet. If they have, I can't find it. So this is, as far as I know, the only one that is doing the preview video this week. So yay, yay to me. Uh, have a good one, guys. Stay safe. See you soon. Bye-bye.